What's up, guys? Welcome back to Chuck's Hobby Spot. Well, I have been gone for five days, so I haven't really done a lot in the shop. So I've been on vacation. I've been at the lake for a few days, so <sighs> I've got to relax, but it's kind of not enough. So uh, I came back Sunday, and I was off Monday, and I just relaxed a bit on Monday. So today we're back in the shop, and... We're gonna do a review on a package I got in the mail because I did get a couple packages. So first of all, I wanna say thank you very much to Dirt Road Cinderella. She had sent us a couple of her stickers. Well, hold on just a sec. So I wanna say thanks. She sent us a couple stickers, so we'll put those up. Uh, there you go. So. She she's a really good supporter of our channel and our podcast. So thank you very much, uh, Tiffany, for doing that. She also sent us a, a panel liner pin, and I believe I did say thank you for that. Thank you very much again for that. So uh, she she's really awesome to have in the community. She's a good builder too. So uh, it's nice to have women builders out there in the community as long as young as well as young builders too. So try to keep a diverse well, some of these women builders are awesome man <laughs> they have a finesse for some reason i don't know so, something that some of these some of us guys don't have you know so i, I mean, some of the best welders i've seen are, are have been w women also so anyway this is okay uh, time to get back to the product come on guys uh thank you very much though tiffany uh another thing I want to do in this video is I'm going to kind of give a little quick update on my Arnold Schwarzenegger because I did get a little a little further in that and um, I'm kind of happy with this it. my first figure and I'm learning flesh tones and, and stuff like that it's not my first figure but it's my first flesh tone figure you know so we're kind of figuring that out and uh yeah let's turn this camera around you want to look at this crap come on let's turn this camera around Check out what VCG Resins sent us this time. You're going to like this. Come on, guys. All right, here we are. So uh, first of all, I want to show you that he sent us a sticker. So uh, so uh, I've got a bunch of these. I, I think they're cool. i got them on, on here right, let me see, right there. So I, I've got them on, on my bench i've got them on my on my printer and uh I, I i've got a stack of them in my drawer so first i want to show you what he sent us he sent us uh nerf bar side steps so uh he these are really really cool i if if i chose to do my jimmy these would be if i chose to do them in a four-wheel drive fashion this is what would go on them for sure because these things are super, super awesome. So uh, there's one side and here's the other. And you can see very clean work. Here are the brackets for them. Two brackets to each step bar. So uh, those are really, really cool. I mean that when the the need for those come around i will use those because i do plan on doing a four wheel drive pretty soon and those will definitely be something that goes on it so in the second thing that he sent us was the w block 409 weekend rancher engine kit so this engine comes with a variety of options and it, to build it however you would like to do it okay so uh, let's show you what this thing came with. So it it came with the Turbo 400 transmission, automatic transmission, pretty detailed. Let me see if I can show you guys a bit more detail. There you go. Really, really nicely detailed. What I like about this transmission that he sent us is he sent us three different pans okay i like fin pans okay 
and he sent a shallow and a deep some so which is pretty cool so uh it's a little bit deeper on this one than it is that one which there's three options everybody loves to have options okay as far as um carburation on this i'll show you what he sent okay this one here has the Edderbrock performer and the and the the uh the Rochester Quadrajet carbs. So you can do either or. Let me try to get them in there. Look how nicely detailed they are. Look at the air cleaner on there. Very, very detailed. The carbs super detailed. Couldn't have done it better myself, folks. Very nice, look at the linkage on that. Beautiful, man. Let's put those aside. And the block. This block can be, this block can be used as a diorama piece also. It's got the cutouts, you know, for your pistons. That's what's cool about that. Your oil pan pretty detailed oil pan nice and clean as always here's your heads hence why they call it a W block <laughs> 409 has got a distinctive uh, heads and valve covers on them so here's the other one and these are Ready to put spark plug wires in, see that? Holes are already there. Awesome, that's what I like about it. It's one of the things I like. And check this out. Now you got an Edderbrock valve cover, okay? And you have the option of putting a Chevrolet valve cover. Options, that's what I'm talking about, guys. I love options. So uh, I don't have to show you the other valve covers because you know they're just the same. The headers on this, pretty awesome. Long tube headers. Very clean. And you got your stock exhaust manifolds. Okay. And here's your intake, and this will fit each carburetor. And clean that is. Very, very, very nice. Got your pulleys and your belts. Look how detailed that pulley is. Diamond chain cover. Your starter, man. This is I like these starters. Check this out. It's even got the wire in there. I mean, how cool is that? Your alternator here. And I'm blowing this up so you can definitely see how nice these things are. Your coil. Pretty nice, is it drilled? Sure is. oil filter pretty detailed your water pump 
And keep in mind, I'm blowing this up. That's why it's probably going to make some people sick. That's an alternator bracket. Look at that. So we don't have to have our alternator just floating in the air, guys. That's cool, that's a nice touch. Your fuel pump. I don't know if these are motor mounts or what they are. I have to ask Josh. It's like motor mounts. Which, that's a cool touch if it is. And this is what I think is real cool. Oh, look at this. Very, very small uh, water line, water neck support there. Cool. This is what I think is pretty cool. You can do this, and I've done I've done these all sorts of ways. So your distributor here, like like it would be like normal. See that? Like if you wanted to put one, like hollow hoses on there on the top of that, or you can put your wires in the middle, which I've seen people do, and just fold them over. And your vacuum advance is drilled out, which is very very nice detail. Or which I will do is put my wires in the holes, and that's cool, guys. Right there, that's cool. No drilling involved. It's just. Bada bing, bada bang. So that's what I got from Josh Reese from VCG Resins. And I want to give him a big, big thank you. He is one of our supporters on our Scale Model Card podcast. He supports my channel. Um, the guy shows nothing but love. He's an awesome dude. Him and Chris Bell both. And they're in kind of like in business together, so... Uh, scale speed garage which we'll be doing a video for scale speed garage very very soon their new file packs that are coming out they're coming out with a mega pack uh, they they revamped their whole site so uh, I do want to go ahead and, and do a little uh, preview on that there too so that's my grandson running up and down the hallway so sorry uh, so we will do a preview on that coming up very very soon the next video will be another package we got in uh, but for now, because we got a couple minutes, I want to give you a little view of what we are doing with Arnold Schwarzenegger. There he is. This is my first uh, kind of, he's not glued together. It's my first go with uh, flesh tone painting and stuff. So let me see here. I don't know if I nailed it or what, guys. The video, the camera doesn't really do its justice too much. This one here, let me see. This one here, I'm gonna do weathered, but I got another one over there that I'm not gonna do weathered. Let's see if I can, there. It's the first time I've ever done like flesh tone work. The camera picks up way too, too much. There's his body. I'm not done with the gun. The shotgun. And this here's been weathered. And the one back here has not been weathered. So I don't know which one I want to put on him. The weathered or the not weathered. Or maybe one of each. I'm weighing towards one of each. Doing those zippers is a pain in the neck. So... This is where we are with Arnold. Um, I'm having fun with this stuff, so I hope you guys enjoy. Um, and we will be starting the bike soon. So we've got everything in primer, everything sanded for the, the fat boy. And uh, it's going to be a fun build, guys. So stick with us. I don't know why you guys watch this crap, but you do. Um, join the Facebook page, Chuck's Hobby Spot. 
Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell. Check out VCG Resins. Great stuff. I just proved it. Uh, check out Scale Speed Garage and, and check out Iceman Collections. Those are some awesome, awesome retailers out there, guys. And don't forget ProTech. ProTech, Charlie from ProTech takes care of everybody. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Talk to you in the next one. Thanks for watching. See you later, guys. Have a great week.